a rocky road because it's fun. Good choice. Better sticks this way. Better sticks? Yeah. You like burning or whatever. <laughs> Think we've got enough? Uh, not yet. Oh, -ho! just trying to get some more. Okay, I can't. I couldn't figure out the last time how to even find the cards, and so I googled it, and it looks like they're super hidden and in random places. So I'm probably not even gonna find them. Uh, so that's cool. But whatever. So this place was an actual quarry? Uh, yeah. Apparently some of the caves run pretty deep. It's like a honeycomb under there. Cool. I almost guarantee at some point, if someone, if there's like an option where someone can get stuck in the cave, I almost want to just try and do it to see, I'm gonna see if I can hold on. Let's turn the brightness up a little bit. Can I? Can I? Settings, display. I can turn it up a little bit. Nope. So it it jumps from 67 to 70. I like the look of 70 here. That's a little better. Danger of falling rocks. Looks like a child wrote it. And we're looking for firewood? We're going in here? Oh no, I'm... I guess I did choose Rocky Road, so this makes, uh, makes some sense. But I'm trying to, uh... To woo, uh... Woo the woman. Shit. It's alright, calm down. Camera is so tight right now onto this guy's yeah, back. What was the point of walking through here besides just. There's probably like a card or something in there, but I don't want to look that close. Well, that was kind of useless. So, you ever think about what's next? Like, after we die? It's heavy, man. No, I mean like, the future. Yeah, sometimes. All the time. It's so overwhelming. I know what you mean. Sometimes I just try to like, let it happen, you know? What? Huh? Like, whatever happens is what was meant to happen. Like it's all predetermined. Fate. Hmm. Pedantic. Or uncertain. You know, let's just, let's be uncertain. Right? I don't know. I'm not sure we're supposed to know. Yeah. I think that's wise. Fate just seems so convenient. How so? Because if it's all predetermined and you do something terrible, then you have the excuse of saying, well, it wasn't really me because everything's been pre-planned and then I'm not really in control of my actions, am I? I never really thought about it like that before. I mean, well, it's, it's totally okay if you believe that. Yeah, no, totally. Yeah. Uh, they make this so awkward. Just standing here talking about death. Which I guess may be fitting, you know? And do I go left or do I go up the stairs of ascendance? 
Ascension. I don't know. Some word for up. Oh, can I not? Can't go through there. But I can go right back around in a circle. It's like my uh, my mating dance. I just go in a circle, like some of those birds with the with the feathers. I bet, I bet uh, I this guy picks up a flower are. at some point. Yeah. Up here. Up here, hold these. Sure. This view is just. What are you doing, guy? Sit down, do something. Don't just awkwardly look at her. That's creepy. I mean, it's beautiful up there, but... Do... Oh, do me. Let's be sincere. We're trying to... Dude, oh, it's totally be, party time. Really good. Almost. No, We're gathering firewood for the party right now. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah. I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course. I just... <laughs> don't know what. We've got, we've got some good wood. I tell you what. At least from the looks of it. Figure it out. See, all of a sudden this guy's showing that he's got some sort of, uh... Emotional depth to him. Well, uh -oh. huh? yeah, it sounds like a pig or it's something. Probably nothing. No, listen, there's something there. That's a pig, or like a boar. If we get attacked, it's a little pig. Oh, look at him. That's not a so pig, is it? What is that? That is a pig. It's like a, a oh tiger God, pig. So yeah, bring him to the party. Look at the guy! Hold on. Uh oh. Mama pig. Hold on. Save. Yup, just got attacked by a boar. Eat it, eat one. Oh, yo! You're in danger. We're not having bacon. Hunted by a creature of indeterminate origin. Don't breathe. You need to stop breathing. Tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting then which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, causing serious consequences. Oh no. So should I hold breath? When do I know it? Oh, oh. Yeah, we're not getting eaten by a boar. That's not going to be the first death. Oh, he's stepping around. She can probably mumble boar. The music makes it sound safe. Oh! Oh, no. Run. Oh. I hid behind her? Come on, man. It was close. That thing almost just mowed me to death. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, little piggy hog. <laughs> A 
Let's imagine this story. I like to think this about that. It's a good funny. story to tell a pig husband. How do you know it was the mommy pig? I got a pretty good look. Ew. I think she was coming on to me. Oh, got yourself a little girlfriend. Well, she wasn't that little. <laughs> <laughs> Comical. <laughs> oh, good. So. All right, now it's the time to make the move. Look, the sun, the sun's setting, man. Drop the wood and sit down. Guess we should head back. Oh. He probably should have looked a little bit stronger and not, you know, hid behind her after he ran away from the boar. That was probably not the best... Uh, you know, thing to do. <sighs> Finally get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick. <laughs> I feel like we'd all feel like that. No technology for a while and then all of a sudden we get it back and, oh, this is stupid. But look, I can take photos of the sunset. Is something gonna be here? Can I like zoom? No? Okay, I guess I'm taking a picture of the sunset. Or something. It's a decent angle. Whoa, it's Wendy Wu. Yeah, no, it's uh it's London Tipton, man. Yeah, she became a camp counselor. Zach and Cody were there, too. It was hey, awesome. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret And this is room. their, like, older brother. No, that's not... Whoa, now, back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Fuck it off, man. He, he's just got trail cameras set up. You know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh. You don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Still no service. Ah, uh, yeah. So, pretty boring. I wonder, maybe a satellite fell out of the sky or something? Yeah, and landed in the forest, waking from her slumber, the hag uh, hack is. Okay. You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I oh, guess they dear. do, but... DJ. All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick, just in time. We got wood. Those are some tight pants. We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. And then hid behind her. Oh, the hog of Hackett's quarry? Oh my gosh, it can't be. The hog of Hackett's quarry? What? I thought you hated that phrase. <laughs> big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. Oh, I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and peep at you when I need a little pick-me-up. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> we said that like the same time. We're on the same page. Oh. Ryan thinks you're Special making delivery. Ryan. Uh... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell did that gun come right, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh, well, I yeah. mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine, fine. We'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And and. We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop. 
I didn't even know you could still oh, find you. these anywhere. Oh, hey, hey, cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Am I? Please hand me the shotgun. What, you're going to shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. Nah, dude. Absolutely oh, not. No. Not leaving you with a gun. Oh, uh, oh, come on. Uh, let's be a little stern. We got to have someone who's going to be the boss. There is no way but... I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Oh, come on, look, the shooting They're range is like alone. right over there. Okay, it'll be fun. Okay, look. You and me, old-fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, mm -hmm. all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. All right. Yeah. Guess we're gonna have ourselves an old fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. This is a great lead up to this is how you shoot in this game. That was that was well done. Goodness, this isn't like a critic. That was well done. I enjoyed so, that. Just so you know, I was an expert marksman, third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick. But if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you'd actually... Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so is it just me? Is it kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. So, um, how was your little one-on-one -on -one with Abby in the woods? Oh, we gotta be hopeful, right? It was... It was okay. Hey, that a boy! So, yeah. I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. Nothing. She's really smart. Yeah? Mm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 hey, look, no sweat, okay? We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <sighs> okay, please just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obs. Obs, yeah. All right, right stick to look. Oh, my. Wait. Are we shooting the watermelons? All right, Nick, one point. Okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Okay, good. Yeah, these very aggressive looking watermelons. All right, Nick. These were supposed to be real. like these, you know, highly sought after watermelons that we were gonna just pour vodka in and now we're gonna just blast them with a shotgun. Nice All right. shot. Yeah. Lucky. <laughs> Let's go left farther. Let's get a little two for one spash. Or what just do one. You, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. 
Yeah, you shot a watermelon in two bottles from like ten feet away. All right, you might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right, just shut up and shoot, Jacob. Huh. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, dude, not with this freaking cannon dude. blaster. <laughs> <laughs> that is like getting shot. No, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. Yeah, he doesn't get to touch the gun again. What was that? Oh, Butter Pop's theme all the way. Ooh, what's that, Jakey? Huh? Huh? Do his dance, too. Pop, pop. Peanut butter, butter okay, pops. Okay, I get it. I get it. He didn't quite do the dance. Oh, yeah, just take them all out. Blam, we thought this was over. What the? Whoa. Oh, she's getting... Yeah. Huh? Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Yeah, she gets the gun. That does look like very succulent watermelon. That, yeah, I'd eat that. Again, the moon. So full for the second day in a row. Or no. Yeah, that was the, I don't know. Maybe it's another full moon. Who knows? Oh, maybe because the last time the guys came, it was a full moon. Maybe they just come every full moon. Maybe they're like a... Uh, Werewolf people hunters. I don't know. This party is lit. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Okay. New idea. Party game. Mm. Come on, people. We might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style? Mm. Okay, house rules are, someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So like normal truth or dare? Yeah. Yes. So we can like make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Now she's gonna play matchmaker. I mean, keep it in your pants. She's got everything planned out in her head. Well, who does get to go first? Well, it's house deals, so. Abigail. Truth or dare? Uh -oh. Um. Oh, am I gonna choose? Sure. Really oh, dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever you slept? Let me answer, though. Oh, uh, I. Interrupt. I don't know. Have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um. Oh, Abby, oh my God, just pick someone. Okay, okay, um... I don't know. Oh, just stop looking okay, around and choose. Wait. My turn. Ryan, truth or dare? Uh, oh, no. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's truth it, right? Truth. He's a talker. I'm an open book. Okay, okay. Seems like Let's it. Let's get right down to it. Let's do. You and Mr. Hackett. There we go. What were you doing in his office? I'll tell you. I, I, I needed some advice. Yeah, I needed some advice. Let's not be mischievous. Mischievous, however you prefer. Be honest. Well, I know what you're fishing for, but it's actually super boring. If you must know, I needed some life advice. Advice, huh? Oh, whoa, whoa, M. Um, okay, I got this. Okay, so uh, if you go to settings, there's an option called incognito mode. And if you press that. No, life advice about school. And, and that's no fair. I've, I've already answered my question. Maybe we can help. Uh, I don't know. You've all got your own shit going on. 
Besides, I, I figured just the mention of the word school would cause Jacob to hemorrhage or something. Whoa, dude, what the hell did I do? All righty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. Yeah, pe two people have gone. Uh, let's ask Caitlin something. She's Caitlin. She's been interesting. What do you say? Truth or dare? Truth. Yeah, truth. Let's see. What did you want to be when you grew up? Ever hook up with? No, let's let's be interested. When you were a kid, what did you want to be when you grew up? Uh, that's kind of a boring question. Got to answer. A homecoming warrior. <laughs> the answer is. I don't know. That's the truth. Ah. Sorry. So, guess it's my turn. A hotel heiress, maybe. I don't know. I smell bullshit. Okay, fine. You got me. I wanted to be a street performer. <laughs> no way. Well, um... <laughs> a street performer? You mean like, um... <laughs> like... No, asshole. Like a mime or, you know, one of those statue guys oh, that move when you give them a dollar. Caitlin is a mime? Yeah, no, I just can't imagine that. Thanks, Ryan. Well played. Now it's my turn. Emma. There. Uh-oh. Oh, that was quick. Emma, so you have to kiss. Oh, well, that was quick. Jacob? Or... Oh. Nick? Uh. Uh oh. Um. Uh, sorry, Nick. This is not uh, there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. <gasps> of course she does. M. Oh, Seriously? she's out for blood. Guys. Oh, nobody's happy about this. Oh. Oh, his eyes are Guys. He's looking into her soul. Yeah. Thank you, Nick. He's good. We were all friends here. You're like kissing my girlfriend. Yeah, no. Oh, come on, it was just man. A game. Hey, I'm nobody's <laughs> girlfriend. The fuck it was. It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. You guys had one beer. Jacob, grow and up. And two slices of watermelon. And he's like this? Well, I guess I should probably go after him. You should probably go find Abby. Yeah. So, anybody want to play Parcheesi? What? Uh oh, they're right there. Guys, open your eyeballs and look at these two creepy gentlemen. No one in this game can see.